I mean, Orianna would be pretty nice here. They have a lot of ball delivery with the Rek'Sai, with the Maokai. Uh, you know, you're able to get that ball onto the Maokai, you know, jump on the carry and take them out. And hashtag TL win or hashtag NRG win for which team you think it's going to be. Matt looking for a tornado Nardoc. off on the wall. Body slam. Does hit Moon. Body slam flash in. Plenty of damage. Exhaust on the Altec. He burns the E actually learns Relentless Pursuit to run away relentlessly. Wow, another body go. slam lands. Summoner Hill hits up Moon. A couple hits will do it. One more! And they're going to get first blood. What a way to start the series. What a play Liquid. from Dardock. The three-man body slam back to back. Incredible stuff. We're basically back on equal footing in terms of actual power. You can see that fight coming in. Piglet just getting a few autos in. Popping W pass. But look at the damage oh of the Conquan. This is a really good trade. Nearly picks off Altec. He didn't have to burn Summoner Heal, but certainly plenty of damage dealt there. Thing here, once he came on that side of the map, he knew he had map control, and that was well played. Once again, an attempt coming in. The Janna knock up on a Conquan, who did not flash away until after he gets knocked up. Gets over the wall, will survive. And he spots GBM. GBM actually going to get hit up right now. Plenty of damage coming through on him. Doesn't have quite the burst to kill him, but gets Shockwave back into the distortion. It's once of cast to disengage, but now Conquan missing flash. Might have a hard time to get in this oh, one. Nardoc, great body slam over the wall. TB coming in. Also, the Rek'Sai ulti. A knockback comes in from Phoenix's Azir, but there is nowhere else for Dardock to go. Burns his own flash, try to get away, but Moon has re-engaged this one and will finally get a kill on the board for energy. So finally, something answered. Quite a lot. He's down 26 CS, oh. but here comes Impact. Oh, the ultimate out from Phoenix is... as a flat yeah. from Impact, too. Pretty easy disengage there. Phoenix presses R and Impact lost way longer of cooldowns with no gain to be had. Phoenix back to farming as though nothing ever happened. Still just plays the farm game. And ooh, wow, nice. The threat of Body Slam Flash made GBM flash early. And a good bait Lolo by Dardock. Behind, have to burn the summoner. Lolo from behind. Plenty of damage coming in under this one. Going to try to get the slow to come through on the back side of Q. Will do so. GBM. Ooh, okay. Lolo flashes out from the shock. Didn't want to burn ult for that one, but now Phoenix he is injured. Chunked. Impact wants in. Yeah, Phoenix took some turret damage, I believe, on that, that oh. run. Good Q by Lorlo, though, gonna slow impact down. He's alone. They just want turrets. And oh, GBM. they want GBM as well. The knockup chain, look at the play. The knockback by Phoenix. Two assists for him into the mid lane tier two. They go as Lorlo, 1v1 up against impact and actually forcing the Maokai to leave it all alone. Mid lane tier two will go down, still battling back and forth. As the time ticks down, impact from health bars running low. Another slow coming out from Lorlo. Here comes the rest of the team, though. Here comes Dardoch. Kwan Kwan and Dardoch and Matt all reinforcing impact will go down. Knock up the middle into the knockback as well. Matt just had to walk in to make that one happen. Another two kills picked up off the rotation topside. Conquad could not help impact, was dead for sure. What a huge lead now for Liquid. Old leads, even in these individual lanes, are just getting enormous. Matt is going to have to get out of there, though. But look at that. That's the thing is Liquid are under so little pressure that Matt gets caught 1v3, flash and goes, yeah, you can't chase that. Your summoners are down. And then it really didn't amount to too much. It was just the outplays in the lane. It'll be a long time till the items could ever catch up. You heard uh, the European analyst desk talk about that. Whoa. Well, hold on. We're going to talk about Lorlo fighting impact a little bit more here as he triggers the pass and it's going to go on an internal cooldown. Now Phoenix roaming down, spotted by a ward while doing so. And in fact, impact is winning this fight right now. Pops his ulti, but there's an Azir right ahead of him now. There's going to be plenty of punishment. Jumps over. The knockback comes in from the soldiers. Run right into his other one, and the kill does come through. Phoenix 2 0 oh, 2. Yeah, no, wait. No, they just don't need to kill it. Stacking up. Okay, I think my Moon's here. Moon? Moon's here. Moon's oh, here. He steals it. Energy is good. Baron, you've got to be kidding me. But this could still be a slaughter. Two kills picked up for it. 900 gold picked up for the 1500 gold Baron. How many I mean, barons how do they do it? are they going to steal? Just press R! Two members dead means top lane and hip is open. Baron buff or not, it's a 3v5. And this steal may not be what actually keeps energy in the game and doesn't get them any control. It's going to be just a little bit of a stall there so that TL doesn't have it. Touch that again. Moon already tunnels, so they know he doesn't have tunnel. He flashes in, and then early smite Ooh. by Dardoch. That was, did ult. That was 1,500 when he went for the smite. So. Yeah, they're going to be down 11,000 gold. They're also going to be down that 6% AD and AP buff from Dragon 1. Is that I really like this build from Phoenix. Because he has the Rylus Crystal Scepter now, and he's able to penetrate through impact with that with that. Oh, it's wow. Really good. GBM nearly loses his armored shell right there. Oriana limping around now, leaking oil, having to run back now to the fountain and heal back up. And the 5v4, because of that, means the inhibitor does go down. Baron buff has timed out.
Smart choices by Liquid and good identification by my wonderful co-casters. Here comes the TP from Impact. <laughs> okay, here comes the play onto the flank, but they're going to re-engage first on a GBM. Gets stunned up, knocked around, and eviscerated. One, two kills picked up so far. Matt kites back in the backside. Here comes Impact in the front, but three kills now picked up. The flash follow. That's Altec dead as well. Impact, the lone tree running away out of season, honestly. And might literally be so as... Game one is going to end. Liquid, sub 30 minutes in completely controlled fashion. First blood, first turret, first everything, except the Baron. They're going to close this one out. Congratulations, Liquid. Game one of this best of five goes to them.